Hey guys, Rox from DShack Tech, and today I'll be doing my Mac OS X Health Hints Episode 10, where I'll be showing you guys a few tips, tricks, and applications that'll make your OS X experience just a little bit better. So with that, let's begin the episode of Mac OS X Health Hints. So the first thing I want to show you today is how to clean up your menu bar on the top of your desktop. Um, you're actually able to remove items that you don't want from the menu bar by just simply hitting the command and clicking at the same time and you're able to remove them just as you see here. Um, this only works with Apple applications and icons though. Um, to remove third party applications such as Twitterific and other applications that use the menu bar um, icon, you have to do that through their own preferences and um, remove it from the menu bar through the actual application. The next thing I want to show you is how to easily switch between desktop applications without searching through various desktops and using the spotlight feature. All you gotta do is hit command and tab while holding on onto command for as long as you want. A new panel will appear with all your apps that are currently running. To go through them all, all you gotta do is hit tab again and it goes mo and it moves over or you can just use the mouse to select which one you want. You can also easily quit these applications by having the one selected and hitting Q at the same time and it'll actually quit the application from that panel. Things are pretty cool and efficient way to switch between applications and quit all the ones you want in that panel. Next I want to show you is an application called Bandito. It is a free application from the Mac App Store and it gives you third party control of the of your Pandora account and the music and your stations and all that. Um, it basically gives you another menu bar icon to sit down and you have all the controls that you would, out, would have on the Pandora website. And this solves the main problem of Pandora, which is having always having to have a browser open and having one tab or a, the browser designated to Pandora, and it and it's very easy to quit um, when you're quitting Safari or Google Google Chrome or, or Firefox all at once. You actually delete your Pandora music listening experience, and it's really annoying to have to reopen it and all that. This with with Bandito, it solves that problem by always having it there, having it always logged on. You don't need to have a browser open to listen to your Pandora account. I think it's a pretty cool application that you got, that you should go check out, and it's free, so, um, so it can't really hurt to download and try out. Um, and that's pretty much it for this Mac OS X Health Hints episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it and found it a little bit helpful. Um, check my channel, DShack Tech, and subscribe to notify when I upload more OS X Health Hints, just like this one, um, product reviews, app reviews, and OS X tutorials. Follow me on Twitter and like me on Facebook. Um, thank you for watching, and as always, see you guys next time. Um, I use this basically to have more control of my iTunes outside the iTunes um, application window, which takes up the entire desktop um, on my computer, and just sort of gives you more. The application allows you to do this with any application, with any window application. Um, I find it very easy to do. We have multiple applications on a single window, and you want to have split it halfway through, or maybe take one, take a one.